Greetings from Bermuda, this is BDL Army. Welcome back to Desktop Dungeons Rewind, where we're going to check out the first of the class challenges. Okay, uh, fighter challenges. Bleat it. Gorgons have broken into the kingdom's petting zoo, spreading madness and petrification. Fight your way through the enraged goats and put an end to the Gorgon leader. Defeating this challenge will earn you 150 gold. Uh, so we are doing it with the fighter. And uh, let's do it with the dwarf. Why not? Um, and let's take... Uh, can we do any preparation? Apparently, we cannot. Okay, play then. Okay, so I suppose I should be making use of my fightery skills then. I assume this is kind of like a puzzle, uh, even though it's not in the puzzle section. Uh, so instincts can sense enemies further away in the fog. Veteran gains XP when attacked by higher level enemies and less XP needed per level. And Pit Dog starts with a layer of death protection, which gives us protection against the killing blow. Okay. Um, well, I wonder if we should go and get hit by a level two enemy first then. Give us some XP. Uh, and then we can go over here and kill him. Um, pick up that. Pick up that. It's actually a goat. Uh, but it's only a level 2 goat, so it's fine. If we go and hit him, do we get an extra XP as well? We do. So we'll go hit you. If we go hit him, we'll level up. Can we... Is there any way to kill this guy? I guess there isn't. He's doing 7 damage. Okay, so let's go over here and then hit him. That levels us up. Now we can kill him in one hit. I'm not sure how finely balanced this challenge is, so I don't know whether to what extent I need to be min-maxing everything. Uh, what have we got? I should have looked at this at the start. Won't fit. Summons existing enemy, adding slow debuff, uh, and gives us bonus XP, and then I'm a wall, uh, so petrify an enemy, and then next kill gets 50% bonus experience. Uh, which I think so if we hit if we kill him we get one XP I'm still not sure about this if we killed him we get one XP if we kill him we get two but if we petrify him and then kill him we're still only getting three But I could... I guess I could summon this guy. If we do that, so petrify you. And if we kill him, yeah, I'm getting three, so we're no better off, net net. But, uh... We do this. And now we kill you, and we're getting six, because we get the bonus XP from this, or from this. Um, which, wait, no, hang on. The experience boost is coming from I'm a wall. Well, the experience boost is coming from both, actually. Anyway, we're getting four from killing him now rather than three before just summoning him. So that is a good deal. Um... Let's maybe explore a little more, see whether we can find some attack power-ups would be nice. Failing that. Let's just kill you. Extra health, and what's the shop selling? A bloody sigil. 
Uh, regen plus 5 HP, minus 10% damage. Movable magical to 2, which painfully binds itself to a host, adding three, 5 to max health. Boosting regen while lowering damage by 10. Uh, well, sounds like a good deal. How much cash do we have? 17? Sure. Uh, and again, we should be hitting enemies that are a higher level than us to get the bonus XP. Uh, yeah, we are level 2. Ooh, we hit a level 4 for 2 bonus XP. It doesn't actually do much damage to us and it levels us up, which is nice. Uh, I'm still trying to work out this walling and killing thing. I guess I could wall the level 2 and then... If we can kill the level 4, which we can't. What if we just kill you? Or level... yeah. Use the level 1s as... Uh, I'm a wall fodder. And if we could kill the 4 with that, that would probably level us up to 4 right away. However, he's hitting for 21, which is too much. So. Uh, could do it. With a level two, I guess if we summon again. So why don't we do that? Why don't we wall you? There's no guarantee. Summon, we summoned a level three. Uh, but I guess that's better, actually, because we will get five XP there for killing him, which we can do. Let's go reveal the level one. We can do a similar thing over there. XP for killing him. And we could do the same with the level 2 because he's only given us 2 XP. Why is he hitting for so much more? He's just a tough old goat, basically. Let's go heal a little. Gonna wall you. Let me go here. I'm gonna get some mana back. More attack is good. Uh, let's. I don't know if there's a good place to go when we summon. Is it just summon the closest enemy level to us? I'm not sure how it picks who it summons or whether it's just completely random. Anyway, that gives us um, another five. Which levels us up. Now we want to get hit by this level five. Give us one bonus XP, or oh, is there a six? There is no six. Ah, uh, wait. Death gaze, 50%. Petrifies attackers with less than 50% health. What would happen if we were petrified? I'm not sure I want to find out. Uh, okay, well, we'll take that for one bonus XP. Actually, no, 
we shouldn't have done that. <laughs> right? I'm the one who does the petrification stuff. Not them. Uh, ah, I should not have done that. So now he's going to regenerate. Back to 48. Uh, well, I got an extra XP out of it, I guess. Anna is back to full, so let's petrify you and then summon somebody over here. Mm, okay. Ah, uh, but it actually looks like we can kill him. And get seven, which would have been more than we would have got four plus two by just killing them separately, so that's still a good deal. I feel like I almost got petrified there. I thought I was in the clear, but maybe I wasn't. This goat is like way too tough. Why is he enraged? What does enraged even mean? It's me for more. Probably because I hit him earlier. Guess he didn't like that. Um. Okay, what are we, level four? Let's go over here. Pick up that, pick up that. Another go. Berserk's at 100%. When health drops below 100%, oh, damage is plus 50%. Right, okay, so that's what happened with the other goat. Yeah, wow, those goats are tough. Who can we pick on? So we can kill him. We have no more low-level fodder. Let's see whether we can find some. What is this? A badge of honor. A warrior's mark which adds 10% bonus damage. It can be used to provide death protection. Five for 18, which we don't have. So, we're not doing that. Did this do again? We said maximum health boost regen. Oh wait, shoot. Ha, <laughs> I misread this. It lowers our damage. That's to maximum health boost regen, lowers our damage. Okay, so we made our life harder by buying that. Kind of. It's fine. I think I probably just killed the goat. Killed the goat. And go exploring over here. This is another vendor. A troll heart. Plus two health on level up. Is that worth it for 16? Don't know, but we've got another level one over here. So you're ripe for petrification. Is there a five we can take down? No, he's, he's gonna... He's gonna petrify us. Let's find an easier level five, a goat. What was Berserk again? 50% extra damage. Jesus. So he'll hit for 30 after we hit him once, which is why we are dying quickly. Uh, well, we could still petrify him and even kill a level 4. Yeah, that would work. Sign killer, how you doing? We are playing Desktop Dungeons Rewind, which is a, a remake of a game called Desktop Dungeons, uh, which came out about 10 years ago. Uh, so it's, it's a turn-based puzzle game, really, I guess, um, where you are moving around on maps like this, uh, trying to defeat the boss at the end. Um, and yeah, that's basically it. So this is us. This is our current level. Uh, the green numbers show the level of the of each of the enemies, uh, and the uh, different enemies have various abilities, which you can see over on the right hand side of the screen, um, etc. Um, Depends on the remake, I guess. 
depends on the remake. I played a little bit of this original game, not that much, about 10 hours I think, and I couldn't really remember anything about it before I played this. Um, and the original version of this has been around forever. The devs also gave a free copy of this to anybody who owned the original game, uh, which seems incredibly generous to me. Um, so, as far as this remake goes, I don't think you can really complain. And the original is still available. I think it might be free at the moment as well to anybody. Um, so if you'd rather play that, um, you can. I have played XCOM, yeah. I did love it. XCOM 2. Uh, did I play the original XCOM? I remember. Well, I played XCOM 2 and loved it. Let's petrify you. That gives us more XP. Now we just go hit you twice. No, let's try and get even more XP. And do a summon. Uh, okay. Is that go on full health? He is. Oh, so he's going to get mad. But we can still kill him. And then we level up as well. Okay. We can probably petrify these level twos. Can we? More money. Okay, so we could buy this now. 10% bonus damage. I almost think I should do that to get my damage back that I lost here. Okay. Uh, but it does take up an equipment slot. Or a spell slot. We've only got one more left. Hmm. Might be. I think it's probably worth doing that. Let's buy it. Two more damage. Still. I really little counts. Um, okay, let's... Yeah, like I said, I don't know how much I need to min-max this. I guess that's one criticism of this game. You never know how much you need to min-max it until you get to the end and realize you haven't leveled hard enough. Uh, and you're not equipped to take on the boss. We need a level five to kill if I petrify him. There is a go over here, which we can kill. So let's petrify you. Go over here, summon, summon a Gorgon, that is fine. Get rid of you, give us 8 XP. Oh shoot, I missed the extra attack, that was dumb. We need to heal a bit. Um, I'm trying to think whether I ever played it. Was that the one that came with an app? I don't, I don't, I don't think I did, but I remember playing some board game with an app. Although there was one point in time where there were a bunch of games coming out with apps. I thought it was XCOM, but I don't remember it. Yeah. So maybe it was a different one. Uh, okay, we are gonna heal up a little bit. We're gonna pick that up. We are gonna... Oh, you know what, we might as well. Oh yeah, get that as well. More attack power. Okay, and now we will go and petrify you. If we just... Just straight up kill him we get. Do we get any extra experience from killing a summon? Now I'm not sure. Kill him we go up to 14. So we get 6 XP. I do that. Uh, okay, well I don't know because that was level 5. 
we still want to kill him, that will give us eight. Uh, we petrify the level two. Well, I need to heal a bit. Cover a bit. Oh, we can take a hit from the level seven, so that will give us two bonus XP. How does Death Gaze work? Petrifies attackers if we attack with less than 50% health, I assume. So I assume we can actually hit him and not get petrified. The two bonus XP. We can't use this to regen. Um, get the money. And then... just kill this Gorgon. And that will level us up. Yeah, I guess. No work. Shoot, we won short. Okay, fine. Uh, I think we just, we do this as much as we can. I don't see any reason not to. Summon you, level 5 go. Like, why does it look like we're killing you? We're not gonna kill him. Surely. Taking the chance. We are gonna kill him. Why did. Oh, he does get to hit us back. Yeah, okay. So I'm glad I did do that. And then we level up and heal. So we're good. Okay, to level six. Uh, we're probably doing good, I want to say. Those last words. the point where there's no point petrifying a three to kill a four is that will lose us xp uh but we could petrify a three to kill a six down here definitely like to use this petrification fodder I almost might as well just go kill that goat I think it's worth using him down down is still not doable. Petrify 3 though, that's only going to give us... Bonus XP from that enemy up. I think I can do it this way around, can I? So he will now give us seven. If we petrify him first. He now gives us ten. Okay. That is worth it. We're not less than fifty percent health. Turn to stone. We level up. Okay, nice. 
points. Money. Um, let's go. Are we going to find any more low level dudes? Sure, I guess I may as well just kill you. So I don't think we can turn you into a wall. Um. Oh wow, okay, we've got a level two down here. So this guy is a bit beyond us. Uh, is he a bit beyond us? No, he's not. He's a seven. Yeah, seven. So petrify the two. Over here, summon him. That gives us eleven. find myself. We have rewinded where well, we got death protection, I guess. I don't know if that's useful against being petrified there. Um, so there's probably no enemies here. So we should just use that for uh, regen. Because of the fact that we can see enemies in the fog, we would see any enemies that were there. It's for sale. Uh, oh. Pick your poison. A regulated medicinal supplement. What'll it be? Um, give me a health potion. Oh, can't. Don't have the money. Neither. We're too poor. Okay, let's go reveal. Oh, another level one. That's awesome. first strike I think that's still fine so we turn you into a wall we go there and summon we hit you we kill you we get lots of XP five away from level eight dudes to kill. Explore this middle area. Phew, it's possible this is all inaccessible. But be careful with that as well. Uh, go there. 94. Okay, we wall you. Oh, hello. Be a dear and strike a dashing pose, would you? I can start work on a heroic looking statue for you as soon as I get the hair out of my eyes. Yes, I know, I really ought to tie it back. Regards, Medusa. Um, okay. So this is the final boss. First strike, mana burn. Does that actually mean mana burn? really does mean we lose all of our mana. Petrifies attackers with less than 100% health. Uh, does this mean we have to one-shot her? Well, I guess we either one-shot her or have lots of healing potions. Which we do. We could probably kill her now, I think because he got four potions and it looks like we would kill her in four hits. How, oh, hang on though. No, because this only restores 40% of our health. She's hitting for 41. So we need to have over 100 max health. And we 
wondering whether I should have taken this. Anyway. We're nearly leveled up, so... Let's kill this goat. Which isn't enough to level us up. Still think I'm better saving this one. Are there any, any... Okay, level one here. Two level ones down here. Come on, surely there's some higher level enemies left. I don't want to explore too far in the fog. Well, even petrifying a one and killing a three is an improvement. So, let's do that. Then... We would like to find... There must be somebody else. Surely there must be somebody else. I'm not convinced there's anybody else. I think we would have detected them. Oh, there is, but there's another level one. level 8 the best we're going to get it probably is um okay more mana for what it's worth uh 10 maximum hit points don't have the money still don't have the money Uh, so it's really not going to matter me killing these goats. It's going to do nothing for me. So we just try and see, and there's nothing else. Nothing else. We can't afford that. We can't afford that. Hey, Kelly, how you doing? Yeah, we can get one more XP, but uh, I don't think he does us any good, does it? I was trying to... I was hoping I was going to find somebody else and then wall him and then get the bonus XP off of somebody else. But even if we find somebody else, we're not going to level up to level 9. So, I guess, go smack him. Um, Alright then, Medusa, it's you and me. Wait, do we have enough for another health potion now? Yes. We do, just. Okay, fantastic. Spells are pointless against you anyway. So we just hit you, we heal, we hit you, we heal, and... And hopefully we're good. Hit you, heal. Hit you, heal. Hit you. And we are good. Win! Nice, okay. Not too bad, not too bad. I'm glad I did spend the time at the beginning yeah min maxing because we were only just over level 8 in the end we we're only just over level 8 yeah that is one downside about this game you can you could spend like 25 minutes playing through a level and then get to the end and be like oh i'm not strong enough i've got to restart again anyway fortunately that did not happen that time so we get 20 gold. Uh, I thought we were getting more gold. The trouble has passed and the locals are grateful. This goes to show that just about any problem can be solved if you hit it with a big enough sword. Petting zoo crises included. 